STATE OF TEXAS, A NEW LAW WILL BUMP UP THE AGE ALLOWED TO PURCHASE TOBACCO PRODUCTS FROM 18 TO 21. BUT SOME TEENAGERS SAY EVEN KNOWING THE HEALTH RISKS MIGHT NOT CHANGE MANY MINDS. KT790'S REPORTER TATIANA FAVELA HERE NOW TO EXPLAIN. Social media can be a powerful thing, especially when it comes to spreading the word with Im images that show the effects of what e-cigarettes can do to your health. Tobacco companies really target young people in particular and put a lot of resources into getting them to use early. As the jeweling trend rises, more teens are starting to notice the health risks by spreading the word on social media. Especially if it's, you know, a friend of a friend of a friend, right, it, it can be very, very dangerous um, when you don't know what you're actually consuming. This post gaining attention via Twitter of someone sharing a picture of black dots on the roof of their mouth, later learning from a dental hygienist it's pre-oral cancer. But social media is still used to attract youth from using these electronic devices. There are podcasts, there are YouTube videos that show how you can refill some of these devices that are intended for one-time use only, and you can refill them with a variation of oils. Everyone should do research about everything they ingest or inhale, but that's not going to stop people from doing it. According to the Paso del Norte Health Foundation, tobacco use rates in El Paso for those between 18 to 29 years old was above 21% in 2016. Even though there are links to variation of cancers and diseases, some borderland youth say it's more of just a trend. I think at this point everyone already knows the health risks. Cause I know health risks. All my friends that do it know all the health risks, but they do it anyway because it's, it's more of a social high than an actual, like, what you actually get out of the nicotine chemical is probably not what they're going for versus, like, just that social habit of having your jewel out and with your friends, and it's more of a social thing than actually, you know, wanting to do drugs or whatever. Law prohibiting the tobacco sales of anyone under the age of 21 is expected to go into effect September 1st. Live in the studio, Tatiana Favela, KTSM 9 News. Thank you, Tatiana.